Hey guys, Cambo from EGR Auto. Gonna do a quick walk around video on the EGR Rolltrack Electric as shown here on the Mazda BT50. Now the first thing you notice when you see the EGR Rolltrack Electric is the button pads. We have a button pad on both rear corners to make it convenient for you to operate it on either side of the car. Now the first thing though is we need to unlock it. So I'm gonna unlock it using the vehicle key. This is the car key for the car and this also operates off the remote central locking. You hear it unlock and now I'm just going to hit the button and I'm going to open it. I can stop it anywhere along the track, okay? You just hit the button again and it will stop wherever it likes. I can close it again using the button. And then I can just lock it. The remote central locking kicks in. It locks the roll cover onto the tailgate. If you ever have a flat battery, it comes with an override key. So all you do is you open a little access panel here, you put the key in, you rotate the key, it releases the latches and then you lower your tailgate. You're back into the back of your ute. So if you ever get a flat battery, all's not lost, you can just re-access it. I'm just gonna unlock the car again and we're slowly gonna retract it. As it retracts, you're gonna see onboard LED lighting. Now I'm just gonna stop it halfway down the track, right there, it's gonna show you the LED light on the driver's side. This comes standard, this is included on every EGR Rolltrack Electric. Now, on this model, we're showing two LED lights because we've added the second light. You can purchase the second light off egrauto.com or through our distribution network. I'm just gonna open it up all the way and I'm gonna change sides and show you a few other features. Okay guys, now that I'm on the other side, we get a good chance to have a look at the other features and benefits, starting with the EGR Rolltrack canister. The canister sits at the front of the roll cover and that's where the roll cover goes into when you open it. It rolls up in the side. Now, the EGR roll track, we run spools on either side. We don't run torsion springs. So it rolls in there really nice and tight. And that's why it's the smallest on the market. We don't need a lot of room based on the way we compact it in there. We also have these access panels. The access panels is just something that you can open when you need to service inside the canister. And of course, we have four big drainage tubes. At each corner of the roll track, we have a nice thick aperture drainage tube. Whenever the rain hits, the closed roll cover, the water disperses in through the side rails and out through the drainage channels. We've got some great videos on our website and our YouTube where you can have a look how that operates. Now, up in the front right corner, we have the motor, which is literally the heartbeat of the entire EGR roll track. It's hidden behind a nice cover, but that's where the EGR roll track motor is situated and we have a nice little override button sitting there as well. Obviously, the big feature on the EGR roll cover is the side rails. Now, the side rails is for load capacity, okay? Now we also sell a 150 kilo crossbar rack kit that you can add to your EGR Rolltrack side rails. Now if you don't wanna buy ours, you can put any brand you like because our channel is quite universal. So you can put any brand that you prefer on top of your EGR Rolltrack, but only the EGR Rolltrack crossbars will give you a load rating of 150 kilos. Okay guys, so that's our walk around video on the EGR Rolltrack Electric as shown here on our Mazda BT50. For latest daily up-to-date information, follow EGR Auto on Facebook and on Instagram. And we also have some really, really great videos on EGR TV on YouTube. Thanks.